Hi everybody, Dr. Abbott here. Just wanted to start with test one, the first question. What are the four fundamentals of music? Well, let's start with a song that everybody would know, and I would suggest that I could play this song pretty much anywhere. I could play it at a wedding. When people walk in, people are not going to say, oh, I'm not going in there because they're playing that song. I hate that song. That song would be One Love by Bob Marley. Now, what do we hear in Bob Marley's One Love? This is without talking about the words, okay? Because that is really not what this class is about. This class is about everything but the words. Now, we will discuss the value of words and how they affect culture and society. But really what we're talking about in music are four things that all music has. Number one, the part that you hear Bob Marley singing is called the melody. A melody is defined as a series of single notes moving forward in time. Let's just say that's you in a shower singing by yourself or singing with your headphones on like I have on. You don't care what people think. You're just wailing away at the top of your lungs. It's one note at a time. Because unless you have a very bad cold, your voice is only capable of making one note at a time. Now, if you think about it, those notes are moving across like this. As it's happening, they're happening in some time order. As if to say, you're looking, you're going, okay, now, 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 now. And the ordering, the timing of those sounds, which we call a melody, is rhythm. And rhythm is something that everybody seems to understand. There's a lot of different aspects of rhythm. We'll discuss a lot of them in part one of your book. So melody is single notes, and the timing of the notes is rhythm. Let's assume that you're singing, and while you're singing, Someone is playing the guitar or the piano. Something that hits more than one note at the same time. That is called harmony. So as the melody is moving like this, at certain points, there's notes that happen like this. So we have a horizontal and a vertical way that music is happening. Finally, something has to be making the sound. Is it your voice? Is it a guitar? Is it a piano? What kind of voice do you have? Are you a tenor? Are you a soprano? I mean, what kind of soprano are you? There's different kinds of sopranos. Is it being played on a flute? Is it being played on a clarinet? What's the difference in clarinet sounds? There's a bass clarinet and an alto clarinet. This is called tone color. Something has to be making the sound. So those are our four fundamentals right off the bat. So when we listen, to Bob Marley's One Love. Can you hear the melody? How do you know it's the melody? You're very good at knowing what melody is. You've listened to thousands of melodies. How about the rhythm? Can you hear the drums playing the rhythm? Well, guess what? Everything that's happening is in rhythm. And then there's some guitars. There's all kinds of harmony instruments that are playing, and they have to know what harmony to play at what particular spot. And of course, then there's the sounds that make you go, that's reggae. I know that's reggae because it has these specific sounds. So you'll notice that certain styles of music have certain sounds or tone colors, as we call them, coloring. So those are our four fundamentals, melody, rhythm, harmony, and tone color.